deliver Pat Fry our um, signed petitions from our nurses. Um, obviously you can see he they locked the door before we could even approach. They'll send out nobody significant other than very low-level managers to talk to us. Does anybody have the common courtesy to come and speak to us directly rather than having us stand outside the building? Thank you. <laughs> Can I help you? Yes. Yeah. Um, we are all Sutter registered nurses. Mm -hmm. We're here representing 10 facilities currently in negotiations with Sutter. Mm -hmm. And we're here to deliver cards from 90% of the 5,000 nurses um, that are currently in negotiations. Our nurses feel very disrespected, very unheard. <laughs> Yesterday I called my CEO because he wasn't in the office. We, wanted, we went to the office to present the cards that nurses signed, saying that they support me and the other bargaining members. Gary Rappaport was not there in the office, so uh, I, had a, I had a cell phone number from, um, it was posted on the internet to all the nurses, and I called him and I told him that the nurses did not appreciate the implementation of the last best and final offer. He hung up on me. He didn't even let me finish what I had to say to him. We continue to have significant problems um, in patient care areas and significant nursing issues. Nurses unable to take breaks, no real break relief nurses. Um, Sutter continues to ignore all those significant issues. You know, I'm happy to accept these on their behalf. We don't have anyone available right now. The petitions say that we want, um, we deserve to get a good contract, we deserve union representation, um, and we want Sutter to bargain with us. Um, it states that they had 587 million in profits last year and we deserve to get a fair contract. In order for us to be able to get our point across that we're going to have to strike, that's where we're headed because Sutter Corporate is unwilling to convey or to bargain in good faith. Every single one of us that's here is here because we're concerned about our patients and we're concerned about staffing ratios and the scope of practice of nursing. So we're asking all of you to please continue to support us and please continue to stand firm in solidarity and in union. Thank you.